She's here. Sweetie, come. Is it for me? Yes, open it. What? I think I'm way too old to play with this, mommy. I think it's, it's not for you. It's for your baby sister that's coming. What? A baby sister? Yes, honey. We are having a baby. You're gonna be the big sister. I don't want to have a sister. I don't want to. Nelly, stop. What are you doing? You're going to hurt your sister. I hope so. I hope she's not born. <gasps> Nelly. What happened? Are you okay? Yes. It's alright. It's okay, honey. You'll never be a part of my family! Damn baby! Nelly. Your sister's news surprised you. But you see, when my baby is born, you love her as much as we do. That thing is not my sister. Just get out of my room. Enough, Nelly. Like it or not, you're going to accept your sister. Baby, you've always been a nice and noble daughter. We don't understand what's wrong with you. I just can't be the second place, Mom. She'll grab my dolls and steal my position as an only daughter. No, honey, don't say that. You'll always be your favorite one. You'll see that when, when your sister is here, we're gonna love you and care just as much, okay? <sighs> I love you. You'll never be my sister, and I'll make sure to turn your life into a living hell, disgusting intruder. No, count one more time. 17 plus 3? 20. Exactly. Count. Count properly. 13. 4 plus 5? Honey, what's wrong? Are you okay? What's wrong, Josoni? Josoni, are you okay? <gasps> Oh! God. The, the baby's coming! What happened, Mom? Did you take a whiz? Your sister is almost born. Help me, please. Grab your things to go to the hospital. I don't want to go. I don't care if she's born or not. Nelly, please don't make your dad angry. Grab your things or go to the hospital. Come on, easy, honey. Breathe, honey. Careful. Be careful. Open the door, Nelly. Slow. How are you? My auntie looks so happy holding your new sister. Hmm. Hmm. Too bad you're not the princess of the house anymore. Now someone else is taking your place. That's a lie. My parents love me way more than that intruder. I'm glad I'm an only child. That way I have all my parents' love and affection. All for myself. I like you. That's like you're lying, Joan. You are so jealous, very jealous. Shut up, Joan! <clears throat> Mom, that's never gonna happen. What's going on here? <laughs> Nelly, cut it out. What happened? She says just because you have the baby, you'll stop loving me. She's lying. Nelly, she's no stranger. She's your sister whether you like it or not, and you have no reason to talk about her like that. Go to your room. You're grounded. But Daddy, I... Oh, nothing. Go to your room. I'm awfully sorry. Nelly's not like that. I don't know what's wrong with her. That's okay. Are you all right, baby? Yes, Mommy. Come inside. Hey, 
sister, how are you? Fine, thanks, she's huge, Mommy. you have no idea. Mommy, wanna play? No, honey, not right now, go play at the park, go. Oh, she's so grown, she's gorgeous. You have to come visit her again, okay? Really? Well, when you want, I can cook something for you. The trash should be in its place. No, Nelly! What were you gonna do? Nelly, she's your sister. Go to your room and stay there. I'm telling your dad what you did as soon as he gets. I hate you! I hate you and I hate that ugly thing you're holding in your arms! Nelly! Nelly, get back here! Honey, we have to take Nelly to a psychologist. The behavior she's having is not normal towards her sister. Are you crazy or what? Her head is perfectly fine. Gustavo, she tried to toss the baby in the trash can. Just honey, you're exaggerating. All that kid has is she's whining and throws tantrums, you know? She has to understand the attention is not focused on her. She's going through a tough time and... And I get it. Well, yeah. I hope she understands that a baby needs a lot of attention and time. She'll have to deal with it. You are a burden. You took my parents' love away. And also, being an only child. What's wrong? Why are you purple? What's happening? Nelly. The baby. Nelly. 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 But what did you do to your sister? Nothing. She was turning purple and I think she was choking. What? Give her to me. How is she? I perfectly know you did something to her. Because you have always been jealous of her. You've never loved her. I swear I didn't, Mommy. I'm telling you the truth. I can't believe how far you've gone, Nelly. It's okay, sweetie. Just honey. Nelly's telling the truth. I'm sorry. You're a good kid. You saved your sister from choking with that. Honey, without you, she wouldn't be alive. Nelly, I always knew you loved your sister. You saved her life. You did what's right. You see? I saved your life. <laughs> Mommy, Daddy, I'm sorry for not being a good sister for her. Oh, my love. I was just mad. I thought she was gonna take all your love away from me. No, darling. Sweetie, we're sorry. For making you feel lonely and unloved and for paying more attention to your sister. Nelly. We're always going to love you. The only difference is your sister needs a little bit more care because she's little. But that doesn't mean that we're going to stop loving you. Forgive me? Yes. Mommy, I'm gonna care for her and protect her because I'm her bigger sister. <laughs> of course, honey.
A lot of times kids have trouble accepting that they have a new sibling. Therefore, let's not let their feelings out. And let's listen to our kids through how they feel. Let's explain to them they don't have an enemy at home, but a friend who they can share their time, affection, and space with. But most importantly, their love. 